Oh boy, Nathan. Oh. Oh boy. Uh, welcome to the Gamers Game Podcast episode. Did you hear that? You hear that thunder? Yeah. It's crazy, man. I mean, it's I'm a lot scared. of uh, Don't be scared. Uh, welcome to the Gamers Game Podcast episode. Uh, what Something. now? Something. Yeah, like Seven, who gives a shit? Wait. Yeah, something like that. Woo! Because I'm leaving. Yeah. Screw it. All right, let's get out of here. We are leaving. I am leaving the, this place. I'm leaving the gamer scene. Such we are going to find a new place, a new shelter. Yeah, I know, right? That scared me. Uh, so you heard that thunder, right? That's like the Fuck thunder. You between, thunder. Uh, Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that kind of thunder really? is. Okay. Oh God. That thunder is like the sign of things to come. Yeah. So um. Yeah, uh, if you Storm don't know, we're never actually die. Oh, oh God, that hurt. and this podcast at the same time. <laughs> oh. There's two Endermen, there's two Endermen. Why'd you look at them? Because I can. You idiot. Uh, so if you're just hearing the podcast, you might be <laughs> wondering why they talk about Minecraft <laughs> stuff. I'm scared. You're crazy, Nathan. <laughs> Fine. Uh, let's go back in the place here and go. We'll leave during the morning. It was alright. <laughs> there we go. That was terrible. Oh, creepers outside. So I'm leaving the gamer scene. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god! I hope that. Aha! Close the gate on you. What? You can't get up. <laughs> No, I'm fine. I just oh, saw man, two people out there, yeah, cleverest of people. You really can't get out of that gate. You're crazy. Nah, that's true. Why? Uh, why? Okay, this is why yeah. I feel like... I I feel like the creator of the website doesn't really care. Yep. He doesn't really care about the website. Uh, and I feel like you should care about the content that's going into it. You should care about your writers. You should care about everything that you put into it. And I think Casey's already left. Yeah. I think he went to write at Labyrinth or something like that. Right? I think it's Labyrinth, yeah. I just decided to start listening to their podcast. Same. And it's actually pretty good. And I decided I wanted to leave the gamer scene and start making my own stuff. That's why I started my channel. Which don't subscribe. God damn it, Nathan. This is not how I make YouTube videos. I don't just tell people to yell at subscribe and like. Like, favorite, comment, subscribe, yeah! Damn it. I've never made YouTube videos, so I wouldn't have a clue how to do that, so yeah. <laughs> yeah. To the but ocean! Uh, <laughs> Ow. I, I try not to yell at subscribe anymore because I feel it's kind of spammy and I feel like a jerk whenever I do it so I think we should head back because I don't want to swim in the ocean what are you doing I got him it's okay chicken's dead <laughs> it's like Jaws over there yeah so yeah, all right. Let's yeah, uh, head. Good idea. Let's get out so of here. So carry on. <laughs> so I, I pretty much just wanted to start my own thing since I know I'm going to be doing this and, and I don't care. I'm so going to leave me. too. <gasps> Why is that? Yeah. Yeah, I've been there two years and I have. Jesus Christ, two uh, years. Yeah. Well, well, it's a year, really. It's like almost a year. You came in the summer. No, I came in August. Was it August? Yeah. Yep. The end of August. Wow, so maybe I'm like a year and a half then. And uh, I became the social curator. I thought I was pretty good at it too. Oh, no, you God weren't. You were crap. <laughs> yeah, which didn't really, so you didn't. Really... But anyways, uh, Zach gave me a review code for a game. What, I, what I think game it was, was it? Something like a Crawling Chaos of Oz or something. It was an adventure an game. An adventure yeah. game. And then uh, I became a writer for the website. Yeah, and I went up to Nathan. I said, "Hey, I want to be the reviews editor of the website," and I became pretty good at it. I think I wasn't great, <laughs> but I was all right. 
What do you think? You were. Yeah, you, I was. You yeah. you were my right hand man, so. And you're my right hand side man in this game. You were. Still are. Yeah, man. You're <laughs> my T dog. You're my homeboy. <laughs> Yeah, so what we're going to talk about in this episode is... Well, it's going to be a little bit different. We're going to talk about The Walking Dead yeah, and everything else. Uh, like Star Wars, we're going to talk about yeah, you know, what we're going to look forward to in 2013. A whole bunch of stuff. We're so diverse. Yeah, I refused iron armor because it soils my stormtrooper armor. It's true. Yeah, yeah, stormtrooper armor can take on anything, as the films have shown. <laughs> it's going to end badly. <laughs> One arrow and I'm dead. I can guarantee. You. Yeah. Oh, hang on. I have to increase my draw limit. Uh, I think. Right. Um, what draw um, you on? Short. I have to change it to. At least normal. I'm on short. Yeah, I have either. to live with short. Yay! Yeah. Well, let's keep going. So you said you're leaving the uh, gamer scene. Do I give a reason? Yeah, I am. Well, uh, I started off as a writer for a couple of months, and then I was randomly promoted to editor in chief. Oh, wow. By no, who? Simon. Oh. Yeah, but we don't know which Simon. Simon well, I didn't says. really want to say his name on the podcast. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and, uh, oh, don't really mind about names. I don't really know. Yeah. I need water. No, I'm joking. Um, yeah, he, he promoted me, and then I was just like editor-in-chief from then on, which is weird because I never had any experience doing stuff like that. It was oh, wow. really, really random. And it wasn't really a hard job, admittedly. But you love the power. But yeah, I like being right? editor-in-chief now. So I still always am. But yeah, I'm leaving the, the game. The power! <laughs> the, the power is yours. Yeah. Um, I, <laughs> I'm leaving <laughs> for better projects. I have my own projects in mind. I'm still at university studying journalism. So I have a lot of stuff to do in terms of that. Yeah, and I just don't have any passion for the gaming scene anymore. I don't think Very few people does, really. do, I must admit. Yeah, that's for sure. I think the website's dead. It's definitely if you ask dead. Me. It's, it's dead. Just, yeah. It's better than fried chicken. Just the fact that <laughs> uh, the owner, as you said, who isn't called Simon, yes, um, the, owner. <laughs> he, the fact or that he is, just you never didn't do anything it was kind of the nail in the coffin. What the hell was that? It's a wolf. No, it felt sound like something fell. Really? Yeah. I I did. I pushed a wolf off. Uh, that ah! wasn't the sound though. Oh crap! <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, yeah. So the gamer scene died a long time ago. Definitely. It was. It def definitely, definitely was. Yeah, let's, let's be cheery. Let's be happy. I've lost you as well. So let's not think about oh, it anymore. No, let's let's move on to tree. bigger and better things. Yes, I look like a cheery in real life. How did you know? Yep. I have absolutely no idea Ooh, where you are. Apple. This is what you do, Thomas. You run away from me. <laughs> oh no, I found some. I found some dropped wool. Oh fuck! What the hell? Oh, uh, just creeper Where blowing are up, you? That's all. God damn it. <laughs> Look for my name. Oh, I see you. I see you. Oh, hello. There's just loads right of wool. Dropped. I take it you murdered loads of sheep. No, it wasn't me. Well, there's just like the remnants of sheep remains all over the place. You know, like, wolf don't like sheep. We can make one. I've just I've picked up two wool. Have you got uh, any wool? I should have taken a bed with me. Nah, we have to. There's some sheep no, over I have here. One piece of wool. Die! Yay, sheep! Kill them! 
So, what do you yes. want to talk about first? No, this talk weekend. The Walking Dead. It starts this Sunday. Sunday, not Sunday. It. Sunday. Not, not in the UK, though. So I have to watch it by other means. Oh, why not? If you haven't uh, seen sucks. the latest season, so, uh, you stop wanna watching now. Tell us what but, happened um, at the end of... Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, I think we're going to talk about a lot of that. Uh. Yeah, that's true. We're gonna do a full spoiler cast. Um, yeah, the ending of last season. Yeah. Oh so, uh, my God! You want to tell us what happened at the end of yeah. this season? Yes. The governor got his eye stabbed out. Oh my God! Yeah. Oh my God! <laughs> uh, Dowell and Will are kind of screwed. They have to fight each other. That's how it ended. Yeah. That the was governor was cool. like, "Oh, you got to fight each other." It's like, "Oh no, we're brothers." But. Yeah, like in my opinion, this isn't in the comics, by the way. In my opinion, I think <laughs> Merle's going to die at the beginning of the season. Because uh, they're not going to kill off Daryl at all. Yeah. No, of course Definitely. not. Of course they won't kill off Daryl. He's like their most oh, popular yeah. character. You see... And, uh, yeah. If you think of it from a marketing Definitely standpoint... He is the most popular uh, character. He resonates most with. But the it could be a sh shock, and he could die. Because I don't yes, like he won't Merle. Die at all. He's a bit of a knob. It's too safe. Yeah, I'm gonna kill some cow. Yeah, he is total jerk. I hate him from the beginning. Oh god. All right, it's some beef. This is a massive some beef patties. <laughs> yeah, how could you break this one? Yeah, yeah, we're making a house in a swamp. We're so classic. Yeah, let's start making a house. Yeah. Do you know right, let's just make a, a basic house. Yeah, can you? Oh. God, about. I'm not that newbie at Minecraft. <sighs> this looks so ugly. I haven't yeah, got any posh. wood. So. We don't need wood. Uh, just make it out of dirt. Stop being so posh. Oh, yeah, so I think Meryl is definitely going to die. Yeah, he's definitely going to kick the bucket. Definitely. But. This have you seen the trailer for the latest season, the one that's airing this uh, week? No, there's no zombies in it. No, the, get uh, out of this here. season will have no zombies in it, or oh, very few. Why? Why? Honestly, well, it's in the comics. It's or well, in the graphic novel. Sorry, um, it's just surrounding them defending the prison from the governor, which makes a chunk of it, oh, yeah. and that's what this season's going to be like. Interesting. Oh, so. What I thought was going to happen was that they were going to break into the town, uh, like our group, our heroes. They already have. And they'll try to free Daryl. Yeah, maybe. Or will Daryl will fight his way out. Get but it does look on the trailer as though they have actually gone into the town again, so maybe they do. Uh, yeah, maybe they I go back for Daryl. Do you know how to make a house, Thomas? Honestly. Yes, I know how to make a house. <laughs> in the right Please. place. You need to put the yeah. blocks in the right spot. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, um... There's slime here, just floating. Yeah, well, it's a swamp. They spawn no, swamps, slime. mostly. I'm getting slime uh, at the moment. Stop. I, I know how you like slime all Yay. over yourself. Infestation I know how of you like slime. It. You like having slime all over your face. Oh, that's dis... Your viewers <laughs> don't know me. They're going to get a really bad impression of me. Uh, my viewers don't care. Good God. I got them all. I'm going to run out of wood. Got this. Really fast. So can you get us some more uh, wood? Okay, Thanks. I'll get some. So I had an idea of how to end the season. Yeah, yeah, how yeah. End it. New this season. new season. Yeah, I thought they would end the season was that they would go in to free their friend yep. and break the barriers and fail at freeing their friend yeah the D Daryl and a zombie Darryl, herd will yep. come in and destroy the town and like eat people yeah that would be pretty cool hmm yeah oh shit oh what happened uh different color does it matter nah it's a fine no one cares we're just building the foundation for our new home. Yeah, true. 
the new frame, if you will. It's another metaphor. We are laying the foundations. Exactly. Ah, okay. oh, crap. Yeah. Jeez, that slime is loud. Yeah, but there's, there's a lot of footage in the trailer of them uh, defending the prison. Yeah, I didn't know that going in. Well, what happens in the graphic novel is the governor turns up in a tank. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> and I don't know if that's going to happen in this. Well, well, it might because you, you see series. him, you see him looting uh, a bunch of military places. Yeah, you do, but you never. Tank. Oh, for God's sake! <laughs> <laughs> You're not that great at building. I missed. Yeah. So it's not outside the realm of possibilities. Maybe. They have a tank, yeah. I don't think they will. I don't know. I really don't think they will have. There will be a tank in it. Because in the graphic novels, they've got a tank, but they've got no shells, so it just just like runs into the gate, doesn't it? And they just drive it straight into the gate. Yeah, yeah, that's what happened. Yeah. Do you think he's going to die this season? This season? Yeah. Well. Andrea needs to die. No one likes her. Yeah, no one likes her. She's a bitch. She just has sex with random guys who actually who keep heads in rooms. You know what I mean? Yeah. She's, she's not got a great track record of guys. But in the graphic novel, she goes that she um gets with uh oh, what's his name? He died. What's it? The old guy. Um, oh, Herschel. Her, no, not her. Not Herschel. The other guy that that he dies. Oh uh, yeah, I know who you're talking about. Yeah, with the RV. What's his name? Yeah, the guy with the RV, uh, yeah, Dale? Yeah, him. Dale's the guy, right? Yeah, and they have a really big relationship. Yeah, I know, and he lives, he survives quite far into the graphic novels, a lot further than he did in the series. Yeah, he does. Yeah. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, I didn't really Prison. read much up on it, I just kind of like lost my place, but I heard that yeah. he doesn't... It's quite good after that, but they after find the another prison, safe not place great. to go. Yeah, it does go to shit for quite a while. Mm -hmm. So who else do you think they're going to kill? Um, I don't know about Rick. They could kill Rick off. They haven't quite in the novels. They haven't quite in the graphic novels, but it's kind of leaning towards it. Yeah, but I think so. Yeah, I think cool. Rick's arm is definitely going to get chopped off. Because it does in the graphic novels. I'm pretty sure of that. Also, this is a massive spoiler. Uh, do you think the baby's going to die? I have a feeling. Oh shit, creeper! Oh, crap. Get me out of there! Run away! I might have shot an arrow at it and that annoyed it. So that's uh, all right. I got this. Die! 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 Uh, hero. Oh, thanks. <laughs> when he's. Why have you got these big open windows? You haven't got any glass. Well, I want the windows because I don't feel like being trapped inside a house. Just thing. The wooden fortress. Yeah, so do you think the baby's going to die? I don't know. It's possible. Yeah, because the baby gets shot in the graphic novel. But... Uh, Laurie's still alive ah, at that point, oh and no, she's holding. Oh no. uh, stay away! Holding. Stay away! What? Stay away! What? Uh, I just had to fight two skeletons in my sword, bro. Uh, you be fine. Just beat them with you. No, it's okay. I, ha I, I had a double sword. A double sword? Yeah. Uh, um, I mean, Are two you Darth swords. Maul? Yeah, I'm Darth Maul. Star Wars. We'll get onto that in a minute. Oh yeah. Just <laughs> you wait. Yay. Oh. It's amazing. Died. Well, I mean, it is a zombie apocalypse. It's amazing that the baby yeah. lasted this long. Exactly. I didn't think it would survive the birth. I thought they might have been like. But the thing is, it's American TV. Will they really show a baby dying? Well, they might not show it on screen. They might just imply. They might. Yeah, they might imply it. Might imply it died. Do you think they'll still be in the prison at the end of this season? Oh hell no. No, it's going to go shit, and everyone's going to die. I think there's going to be quite a lot of people dying, but I yeah. don't know who. It could be anyone. Uh, just I know that Glenn might still be alive. 
I hope so. Glenn's amazing. So, did you end up watching the VGAs from 2012? No. Well, they had Glenn, Michonne, and Daryl come out. Yeah. Uh, the big three. And those three are the most people that are responding to. So, I think it is safe to say those three won't be killed at yep. the end of the season. Yeah. Michonne won't die. She's only just been introduced. She needs some character development. She's got a lot for a character. Although for Michonne, she could die because The Walking Dead doesn't yeah. care about the black characters. Yeah, and then T-Dog T -Dog dying as well in the latest season. Yeah, there was nothing left of T-Dog at the end of it, though, was there? No, not really. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, but at the beginning of the season, they were like, oh, last season we didn't have much of T-Dog. This season, we're going to have loads of T-Dog. And I was like, yeah, you had a bit of him getting eaten by a, a zombie. Do you know what I mean? It's... <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you've been following about what I've been saying about this TV show, but I've been saying that I said that there was only room enough for one black guy on the show. Mate. There is. And then... It's, a new black guy. it's Tyrese now, isn't it? Yeah. Not this racist or anything, you know. Uh, show is super racist. We, it yeah. is. It's yeah. It's almost as racist as Far, Far Cry Three. I haven't played too much of that yet. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm, I'm meaning to pick it up, but Aliens: Colonial Marines is coming out next week, and I'm it's shit out. Pretty good. On the PS3. I'll Cough. be getting that too on the Xbox. No, I don't, I don't no. have a headset for the PS3. Please, I need someone to play it with. Sorry. Nobody I know is getting it. But I don't have a headset, so you can't talk to me. Tough. Get one. Oh, expensive. <laughs> yeah, we've done plenty of that, haven't we? So, yeah. Uh, let's talk about Star Wars. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh no! It's just... No, don't kill yourself. <laughs> Fucking Star Wars. Because you kill know, over Star I'm, Wars. I'm drowning myself. That's how upset I am. <laughs> I'm just gonna kill myself. No, I'm joking. Um, yeah, Disney have a great track record of just completely ruining franchises and milking the shit out of them. So, if I mean, like, Toy Story 3 is the last Toy Story, and then it's like, no, there's a Toy Story 4 coming out. Yeah, but Toy Story 3 was the best one. Yeah, it one. was, but now they're making a Toy Story 3, so, a 4, sorry. So, oh, I didn't know that. Do you know what I mean? They're not exactly ending on a high. They're milking the hell out oh, of it. That's just kind of sad. Um, yeah, so, uh, standalone Star Wars films are not needed. No, I don't think they are so not either. needed. So they're going to be making at least another five Star Wars films. So you know who's going to be in the next Star Wars film, right? Isn't it Han Solo? Young Han Solo. Oh. I think uh, Young Boba oh. Fett's going to be in there too. We don't need, need Young Boba Fett. He's already getting character development in the Clone Wars. We don't need a film about him. <laughs> Honest to God. And then Young Han Solo. It, fuck that. We don't need Young Han Solo. I think it was Jeff that told me that yeah, there's gonna be a moment where he gets a spaceship and he's gonna be like, "Oh yeah, I got a spaceship. It's so awesome." Kind of yep. like Anakin. Yeah, I know. And like, do you remember before Episode One came out? That was quite a long time. Yeah, I was a. I was, I was quite like young. Eleven but years old. They were like, "Oh my god, it's gonna be so awesome to see the development of Anakin." And then you watched Episode One, you were like, "Oh my god, they fucking ruined him." Do you know what I mean? That's what's gonna happen with Han Solo. Han Solo is a badass right now. And now Anakin... Yeah, that, that, what? that's what I'm fearing. Exactly. Han Solo is going to look like an annoying child. I can guarantee you. Are you an angel? That kind oh, of thing God. is going to be... It. And I'm going to be like, oh my God. That's terrible. Mostly. Ugh. Yeah. yeah. That's just going to annoy the hell out of me. <laughs> Yuck. Hey, why are you getting in the water with a creeper? Han Solo is one of the best... Kids. Oh, wait. They can't blow up in the water, I'm just I think. amazing. Oh, cool. No, I don't think they can. You learn something new. Yeah. The last time I really got into Minecraft was when it was in the alpha. 
But since then, I don't really know but that much. Thomas has these moments where he doesn't play Minecraft and then plays a lot oh, of it. Oh, so much Minecraft. I watch a ton of it, too. Ooh, sand. Ooh. Do you want to get underneath this sand? Yeah, sure. Let's go. Yeah. Let's get some. Why are you using a pickaxe? I don't axe? have a spade. Why are you using a spade? I don't have a spade. Oh, fig, speaking of iron. So, just use your hands. It's the same speed. Yeah, well. You're ruining your pick. Oh, oh god, god damn it, there's iron there. <laughs> yeah, so they're uh, gonna I'll ruin the here. hell out of Han Solo and Boba Fett. You really are. <sighs> Han Solo's gonna be an annoying child. Like, did you see the um the original script for episode three? Uh, no, and haven't. it was like that Han Solo no, was gonna make a cameo on Kashi. Oh yeah, have you seen the yeah, on Kashyyyk, you sent me, didn't you? I showed you. Um, yeah, I showed yeah, you the and concept art. He was supposed to be making a cameo on Kashyyyk, and apparently he was raised on Kashyyyk by the Wookiees. Now, I find it's, it's not fucking Jungle Book. Oh, no. It's not Jungle Book, is it? Uh, Do you know what I mean? It's not makes, Mowgli, or whatever his name is. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's not Mowgli. It's not going to be like raised by wolves or something, like raised by Wookiees. Can I say something? I was actually kind of scared. Yeah. By the Jungle Book. I think I was. I was. Yeah, it just kind of frightened me as a kid. I've just um, purchased the Disney compilation song album thing. Oh, it's so good to listen to all the old Disney songs again. It's so good. Yeah. Oh, it, it's really cool having yeah, to listen really to like, the awesome. Little Mermaid songs again and Lion King and stuff. Oh, I love it. I've been singing along. Oh, man, I think I'm lost. Uh, I don't know. Great. Just, well, How do you get lost? We're like right next to it. Oh, what happened? Oh, God. I have no food. Oh, go I have one piece cows. of bread left. And that's not it. You need that's to true. cook. Oh, no. I'm going to drown. Um, Can I get up? Can I get up? Can I get up? Can I get up? We got, be we got a furnace. Speaking of losing our house. Oh, it's there. Uh, speaking of what? Um, <laughs> I thought I lost it, oh. so it's alright. It's, <laughs> it's okay. It's good. Oh, man. So, uh, can you make a furnace for us? Or something? See the announcement of the new Star Wars game? Uh, yeah. Is it Star Wars Battlefront 3? Is it Star Wars Battlefront 3? No, Wars it's Star Wars, Wars Pinball! Oh. Woo! Because that's what we need. A pinball game. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I'm but fucking that. Star Wars. Come on. Well, I think Star either. Wars is okay, but hang on, the same th it's not the same team who's going to work on Battlefront Three. And I know it Star isn't. Pinball. It's um, Z it's Zen Pinball, isn't it? I think yeah. it's Zen Pinball, like that. the company that make Zen Pinball, and they're doing a Star Wars version of it. But God damn it, I want Battlefront Three, but it's never going to happen. Yeah, no, nah, never. I'm gonna check it out. But is that next gen consoles? So can you please make really? a furnace? Here, I gave I need, you uh, one coal. Oh yeah, crafting bench. Um I need a crafting I'll bench. Make a crafting thing. bench. I don't have any wood. Oh, I do have loads of wood actually. No, I'm making it. If you make one, I'm gonna punch you in your face. No. <laughs> I'm making it. I made it. Challenge made it. accepted! Oh god damn it. <laughs> Get your Ass back here. I'm gonna beat you with this block of wood. Get back here. I think I'm gonna turn Leave me alone. Me. Damn it. Swim. I'm hidden. I'm like Arnie. Do -do -do -do. Yeah. So. You are. Yeah, you're kind of been like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> I have an apple. Uh, so, what do you think of. uh J.J. Abrams taking over this new, directing the new films. I think it's pretty awesome. Yeah, I think, it, I mean, look at Star Trek. Star Trek was amazing. Star Trek was just like the best. Yeah, I think it was actually probably also arguably the best Star Trek film. Yeah, all the other Star Trek films. I I've never really been into Star Trek until I watched the Star Trek film and I was like, oh, this is actually yeah, quite, quite good. I'm looking forward to the next one too. It's going to be pretty awesome. Like, I saw the first 15, well, not the first 15, but I saw 15 minutes of it in the theater. Yep. 3D blew my mind away. Oh, 
The trailer is so yeah. awesome. And I read something. Uh, the 3D and Avatar wasn't as great as I thought it was going to be. Where did you go I see? Thought, you know the local the Avatar. Because I saw. See, I saw it in IMAX. 3D and that was worth it. IMAX was amazing. Yeah, you should have gone to see it in IMAX. It's thirty bucks a ticket for IMAX, though. No, it is here. It's just as bad. It's like thirty pounds a ticket. Here, so, uh. and my nearest one's in like London, so I've got to go all the way to London. Yeah, any cool? And I don't like London. Yeah, I've got a bit of coal. I've got like three. That's enough. That could do, won't it? I've got some iron as well. Okay, right. Yeah. Uh, what was he talking about? Yeah. Um, JJ Abrams will bring a lot to the table, but the standalone films aren't being directed by JJ Abrams. Oh, they're not? I thought they were just the three so films. I didn't know there was more than that. Yeah, exactly. There's, so there's, there's going to be very little collaboration between the, the films, and that. That doesn't sound right. Worrying. I know. It's no, not it's fair. Not. Do you remember how much you loved Star yeah, Wars as a I child? No, They're shitting. No lie, I used to watch every they are shitting. Star Wars film in the original trilogy once a day. I've also got a confession of making that I don't mind the prequels. They got a lot well, of stick, okay? We were kids, we, we loved that kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah, definitely. But they got a lot of stick. But then I realized they're really crappy films. Yeah. But they, they get a lot of stick, and I don't think as a standalone film no, they're, they're good. But because there's tied in Wars universe, they're okay. They're not, no, they're not. I just really? said it recently. Right. Yeah. Granted, episode one is fucking terrible. I mean, Darth Maul. They introduced this amazing. Yeah, he was pretty cool. They introduced this really powerful, amazing Sith, Darth Maul, and he has two lines in it and dies straight away. By a fucking paddle. <laughs> I mean, come on. Yeah? But in The Clone Wars, the latest season, I don't think you watch it, do you? I do, but I said it was crap. They're the best. They actually <laughs> have Darth Maul in it, and he has such good character development in it. You really know him as a character. So good. You should, you should definitely check out. Even oh, the latest. Did someone turn off the lights? No, uh, the. the the cold one out. Oh, okay. Yeah. Let me just no, I... put this in here. Hey, get out of my bed. No. I... Get out of my bed. No. I made that bed for me. No, I... Get out. Oh. It's my bed. You took my bed. Did I? Now I'm yeah. lagging. God damn it, look. I'm in an end of... <laughs> this loop of pain. Ow. <laughs> Hit, me. Hit me. All I'm right. stuck. That's doing oh, yeah, nothing. That's right, it took off the PvP, I think. I'll break the block. Oh. What the? That was but there we go. I was just stuck in an endless <laughs> loop of pain. Yeah. yeah I've got your bed, so fuck you, I'm winning with hey, it. Can you Bye. Give me a bed. Come on. Come on. <laughs> you know, if you go to bed, you, the night won't pass without me. I know. That's what I don't like. I can't play. Make me there a we bed. go. Hardly. Night. Make me a bed, you bastard. Now we've got to snuggle up. I don't have anything to make a bed. Just, just get on, just get on. Just, just get on. Just get on top. On top? Yeah, I <laughs> like that. Oh yeah, oh, God. watch this. Oh yeah. Help. Oh. Right. Oh. Batman's gonna rape you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, sticky keys. Right. This isn't the stormtrooper you're looking no, for. Yes. Yeah. So, I'll make you a bed, shall I? my iron. Also do with some glass. Yeah, we'll do that later. We could do with some glass. Hey, I wonder if uh, if gunpowder works as a fuel. True. <laughs> Bang! Light! <laughs> oh, hello, oh, cow! The cows are invading. Hello! Oh, hello! Oh, crap. I'm gonna cook the cow. Don't burn the cow. No, I'm gonna kill the cow. Die cow. cow. Just put the whole cow in the oven. Don't you dare. No! <laughs> Daisy, no! Run away, Daisy! I kill this slime now. Be free! So many slimes. Look at all these slimes, Nathan. Oh, that was scary. 
Let's see. Look at all these slimes. Oh my god. We're in bed I'm... with slime. Bed. They want top of me. Help. You. I will save you. Help. Oh my god. <laughs> They're quite no, cute. Can we keep, keep them? One. Can we keep them? Only have oh. one. Oh, they, don't, they don't kill these brothers and sisters. Sorry, this must be done. Uh, oh. No. no. I'm going to call him... Steve. S Steve. Something. Yeah. yeah. Slime. Steve the slime. Now, wait here, Steve. Daddy and Daddy are going to get some Daddy shit. and Daddy. I was gonna say mummy and daddy, but I don't know. He's following me! Come on, like come on, Steve! Dog. Come on! So I guess you'd be the mom in the relationship. <laughs> Who's a good Steve? Uh, we're just talking about Steve. What are you guys doing out there? Yeah, so, what else? Let's talk about Lay Miz! Oh, Lay Miz. Lay Miz is great. Oh, oh. so good. So, what do you think? Best it drags on. Yeah. I dream of time gone by. What was so that? much like Anne Hathaway. I dreamed a dream of time gone by. There we go. Oh, I didn't like dream of dream that much. But yeah. Yeah. I only know it because of Subo. Oh yeah. That's. I like that one. Oh. At the end of the day, there's another day over. I like that one as well. That was quite cool. Yeah, yeah. I love that one. Great and then we're bullying at half oh, It's a great one. And that's all you get in the life of the poor. See, so you know, it's you a know the lyrics. It's a war. Oh, yeah. There's nothing yeah. anyone given. Well, we've hit the sea, so... Alright, let's go back. Oh, okay. Let's look around for a cave. Good plan. Good plan. Yeah, so I, I was very impressed with Lame Is. It's a bit yeah, slow. It's to kind of long to begin with. Yeah, at the end, it's so good. Like, I, 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 did, I don't know anything about Lame Is. Like, yeah, I don't know anything about Lame Is. Like, I've never seen the musical. Oh, I, I don't it. know anything about this beforehand, and that was fun. Oh, I've got some. Food. Yeah. Also, spoilers for uh, this movie. If you haven't now. Let's talk about Anne oh. Hathaway's performance. Yeah, she's not in it for very long. No. I liked it. It was very... It was, well, it's not that. It's that everyone was like, oh my God, she's going to win an Oscar for this. She's the best. Yeah, I didn't, she's I didn't the hear that going best. I was like, so I heard, that, I heard that before watching the film and I had this really high impression of her. And then when I saw it i was just like you know what hey it's, it's all right it's just it's just not the you know not what everyone says it is <laughs> like if i hadn't have done... you're like a monkey swinging Whee! from trees i like fucking tarzan <laughs> you're like ampersand i don't know if you get that reference i haven't got that reference so yeah uh, they're just making a movie recently that's all that's why i said it okay But uh, Hugh Jackman and Russell Crowe oh. are pretty awesome. And Russell Crowe was better than Hugh Jackman. Isn't it? Russell Crowe was amazing. I thought he's yeah. I don't really know much about Russell Crowe other than uh, Robin Hood. His work in the Gladiator. It's good. It's really good. Which Robin That's Hood was the he one in? with him? I have a DVD of. Uh, is it the Disney Robin one? Hood. I don't know which one it is. Though. Or is it the um, Kevin Car? One. Oh god, that was, that's an abomination. Don't watch it. <laughs> Did you take a note of our coordinates of our house? Uh, no. The new house? No, I didn't. Ah, well, we're buggered then, aren't we? Yeah, it's alright. I've got some food. Way. I'm food. hungry. I need some food. Nah, I got my own food. I'm hiding from you. Ah, there you go. Oh, I love your meat. Go all over my face. <laughs> yeah, I've never seen Gladiator. Yeah, I don't know. Gladiator kind of put me Java. to sleep. My name is jo John. Java. John. Yeah. At last, we Fucking see hell, each other. True. <laughs> Where are you going? 
I'm getting sugar. Okay, well, I'm gonna go try oh. to find the house. Yeah, it's a lot of singing in the... It's not a musical, it's more of an opera. And... There's a lot of singing in it. Like, us two, what? we're probably the most grilliest no. men alive. Yay. And I'm still single. Yeah. No. Is this something you're not telling me, Thomas? No, no, no. Yeah. I'm not uh, gay. Definitely. I think your viewers know that by now. <laughs> um, yeah, Les Mis was really good, but there's a lot of singing in it. And which I bet you're like, oh, no, it's a musical, but of course there's loads of singing in it. Yeah, but they, they sing. Well, it's the same bloody thing. <laughs> Operas and musicals are not the same. In a musical, they speak they sometimes. And that's like, hello, anywhere. my name's Javert. And it's just like, you don't need to sing that bit. Just talk it. Well, what, yeah, I mean, what if that was like in real life? Okay, like, hello, I'm going for a shit. Like, it just doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, each of their own, I suppose. I'd have preferred it if it was just a musical. Because, like, at, t at the end of the film, I was like, I should just speak singing all the time. Like, that's how it should be. It would be quite cool. That'd be yeah, pretty awesome. Go this way, then. Adventure! Adventure. Yeah. Pop and me. <laughs> yeah, so, like, there was a bit too much singing for my liking, and it was a very long film. <laughs> you have to be patient. Like, didn't you say your parents didn't like it? Yeah, I didn't mind. My parents also love Marmaduke. Oh, God. I have a theory about parents and... They're simple-minded. <laughs> I'm, I'm not No, I'm not being like bad against your parents, but... It's like, well, I have a theory about they, old people If they like movies. Marmaduke... I have a feeling that right. old people love just to go watch a film and not think about it. Yeah. I think mean, that's true. That's just a theory, though. So yeah, like I went to see Life of Pi with my parents, and they didn't really get it. And I was like, it's not hard to get. And I think they just went just to be nice. I think, like I suggested it, and I think they were just like, yeah, why not? And they had no idea what yeah. was going on the whole time. I know. Really, we wanted to make a new house. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, that never ends well. And I, fuck I found a hole. Are you kidding? Oh. Fucking lose you. There's lots of room down here. Where uh, are you? I don't know. Did you go left? Uh, let me get back up there and see if I can find you. I found something. Did you find me? No. Oh, no, maybe. I found I found a cave. Oh, cool. But it's not your cave. Damn it. Not cool. It's my own <sighs> cave. Uh, let's try and look for my name. This see. is what happens when I look after Thomas. He just <laughs> leaves me. I get lost sometimes. I don't it's not know. My fault. Doesn't help that my render distance on short. Oh, I found your name. Okay, I'm just gonna sit still until you find me. Oh, lazy. Hey, you can, at least you can find me. I can't Surprise, see you. motherfucker! Oh crap! Surprise, motherfucker! <laughs> All my right. cave was better. No, is it? Was it really? Let's go find it. It was. It wasn't. I was. Oh. I was just bragging. It was shit. <laughs> my my cave's bigger. Yep. <laughs> Let's go. Um, so what do you want to talk about next? Um, games. Games. Yeah, I've been playing games. Yay. Yeah, games. This is a gaming podcast, right? I've been playing a lot of games. Which I haven't. Because I... Yeah, I'm not very good yeah. at scary uh, games. I've been playing Dead Space so I kind of just tend to leave it. Uh... I don't really find Dead Space all that scary. I never did. Right. Yeah, I, I always thought of them as shooters. So I never get scared. Granted, I don't think Dead Space 3 has this emphasis on horror. I think it's more of like... But even still, in the first one, the second one, I always found them to be more shooter and scary. Yeah. And they like to just jump out of a closet sometimes and go, Boo! Boo! I'm a necromorph! Ooh. How far are you into the game? Oh, not very far. I just reached the. I'm about to reach the planet. Uh, uh, so you're about as far as Rad Brad then. He's about that far. 
I don't, I don't like the DLC ordeal that you have to buy currency and stuff like that. 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 Oh, I didn't really even notice the currency. If it was a free to play game, you can understand about pay yeah, purchases I never like that. Noticed but... it until someone mentioned it to me. Okay. I was like, "Oh, okay." And you don't have to pay for it. I know you don't, but there's going to be people. Uh, no, have yet. you played co-op yet? What happens if you play online co-op and there's a guy that's just like absolutely souped up and is stealing all your kills? But if you're playing online co-op and someone has paid a lot of money and got all the best gear and they're stealing all your kills. Yeah, I would never play uh, online co-op. Necessarily. Some people don't have friends. I don't know, it's just not as much fun as playing with your friends. Yeah, true. Oh, crap. Oh, my God. I almost fell. Oh, no. Oh, I fell in lava. Mm, no, I, into a group of spiders. They're just down there watching me. <laughs> Oh. I know I'm getting surrounded. I'm just gonna watch. You have fun. Oh, and kill the bats. Yeah. The bats don't hurt you. They're just scary. Yeah. I'm just gonna watch. This, this creeper is just watching me. Where is he? You're really good with that bow, eh? Yeah. Yeah, one of my favorite things about what? Dead Space Three is that boobs. Uh, you can like uh, craft uh, weapons uh, now. Oh God damn it! You hope so. And one of my favorite things to craft <clears throat> has been uh, the giant line cutter. Yeah. You can actually take the rotation. I mean, from that uh, plasma cutter and put it on the line gun. Which, which what? Which one? Giant. Uh, so not the plasma, plasma cutter, cutter, not the the. I know which one you mean. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The one that has quite big range. Yeah, it's nice. Awesome. Should we just do amazing? Wow! And and for that reason, that that's, that's why it's the best step to dead space. Yeah. Well, that's not the only reason. Like, the crafting system in, in itself is actually pretty cool. See, I don't know. I'm I'm the kind of guy that isn't too fussed about weapon customization. Well, it's not just weapon customization. Like, it's just like the whole crafting thing. Oh, oh hello. It's a zombie. Oh no. I got him. Nah, I got him. Zombie killer. Right. Yeah, zombie killer. Ow. Stop hurting. Oh me. shit, don't fall down there. Okay. I'll take it. Don't word. Scared. word. <laughs> so, what have you been playing? I have been playing uh, nothing this sucks. last week because I've been doing university work and it sucks. Yeah, That's I know. Cool. How boring is that? And I've been playing some of my Vita, though. I've actually. Just wipe the dust off it, and I've been playing some Little Big Planet. Just some of the user created levels. Cause I can you make levels? No, I can't make any levels. I am rubbish. I just I don't have this design gene that a lot of people oh. have. Like I'm just rubbish at doing. Yeah, I I, yeah, I, I beat lava. Lava's nothing. Oh, that's can a shame. Please move. I need a dick. You're my way. Okay. I don't like it down here. Well, then leave. <laughs> uh, no. All right, Carry on then. On. Yeah, so I haven't really been playing much, but next week, yeah. Aliens Colonial Marines is going to be awesome. Yeah, aliens. Am I Please tell me. Soon, really? Too? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's why you thieving. <laughs> I don't know nothing. Um, yeah. He's got a friend who works for Gearbox. Uh, you mean GameStop? Because <laughs> everyone on the internet has a friend who works for a video game company. Or a retailer. My friend told me this. Really? <gasps> I believe that. <laughs> yeah, so I won't, I won't be getting it till Tuesday at the earliest. That's weird. But have you seen the latest trailer? Oh no, I haven't. What's it like? Oh my god, it's amazing. Yeah, um, it's it's pre-rendered, so it's not like in-game footage or anything. But it's like they 
this looks pretty Go dangerous. through different, you know, the acid blood, it kind of goes through lamps. Yeah, I know. You know, acid blood. Oh, diamond might be down there because there's loads of lava, and that's where I tend to find them. Better route. Yeah, so, you know, like, obviously the alien's acid blood can go through multiple levels. It shows, like, an yeah. alien on the floor, and then the acid blood going through the multiple levels, and what's happening on these multiple levels, and it's really cool. Like, yeah, that sounds awesome. There's some Clony Marines shooting some of the alien pods, and then like a face hugger just jumps at one in slow mo, wraps around his face. It's, it's really cool. I was looking forward to the storyline more than anything, because I really enjoy the alien storylines. Uh, after the second film, during the third, no, it's between second and third, but I think it's during the third one, if anything. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Because you know, in the second so. one, when they're like, oh, we're going to be getting help in like 16 days or whatever, that you play as the people are the help. Oh, so you all die. And so you're going to yeah, you're gonna go there and you're like, oh, everyone's dead. And then you were like, what happened? Mm, that sounds interesting. Yeah, and then just shit tons of aliens, that kind of thing. But I like the idea of like uh, welding doors shut, sure, uh, that sort of thing. And you can proper custom like, like, customize your loadout, which you'll be happy about that. Yeah, that sounds great. Ooh, what's down here? Oh, there's a pathway to the lava. Oh, there's not, not much down there. Oh, we've got a nice, easy way down now. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, ooh, precious lapis lazuli. Oh, so precious. More precious than diamonds. Ah, <laughs> I hear a creeper. And a skeleton. A skeleton. Oh, hello. It's up there. Yeah. <clears throat> You get the skeleton for me? You can't reach him. Oh, oh my god, I'm so low on health. I got him. And now How much food fire. left? I, oh yeah. shit. I, I haven't got my skeleton is almost dead. My my skeleton? Fucking hell. My sword is almost <laughs> depleted. Yeah, I've only got four stakes left. Maybe she go back up to get some. Oh, oh god, I'm lagging. Are you okay? Oh, it's gonna be so good. Yeah. What are you forward to in terms of game releases this year? Uh, probably Bioshock. Infinite. Seriously? Yeah. Are you good? I uh, played when the first. Yeah, when the first one came out, I thought it was the best game that was made in a long time. Oh, I was comparing it. Oh. I'm lagging a bit, wait a minute, I just here. need to... Alright, we'll wait for a second. Yeah. yeah oh, no, uh, no, I'm okay. Was, everyone was comparing it to... It's just my uh, computer, it likes to heat. Too. And I love System Shock 2. Yeah, I'm fine. I only played oh, cool. a demo of it, though. Just don't leave me, because I have no idea how to get out of here. I won't leave you. Oh. Brilliant. <laughs> Wow. Like, I, this is like before, yeah. back. I'll just play a game. Yeah, you just took a consumer, a mindless consumer. Oh! That was terrible. <laughs> no, they don't. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, see, I've played a bit, bit of. Yeah. I'm getting shot. Oh, by... oh God, there he is. Oh, that's skeleton. I'm gonna kill for you. Oh God, I'm. I got him. I got him. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna oh. die. Yeah. Get him. Stay alive. I've only really? got half a heart left. Oh God. I have no sword. Yeah. I mean, have you seen how many times I've been shot? Look at me. <laughs> You're like a pincushion. There's like yeah, I'm just yeah. I can't drink anything because it will just all pour out of me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, me neither. Should we just dig up? No, it's uh, true. Yeah, ah, be fine. Yolo, right? <laughs> exactly. I think it was right here. I don't know. Yeah, it's right here. Yeah, 
It looks like it. There we go. Find a way up. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So, have you uh, seen like the beginning thing for uh, Shark Infinite? Yeah, I won't know. The opening scene of what? Uh, I've seen it. Yeah, they it's released got, like, it. this whole religious angle to it, and uh, I think like the first person baptism. Yeah. yeah, that was pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I like the idea of that. I'll definitely be checching it out, but so it's not on my like off of my list. Oh, I'm really looking forward to be playing The Last of Us. Yeah, sounds really, really cool oh, game. I really am. It's going to be absolutely awesome. Oh, well, hopefully, anyway. Um, yeah, apart from the fact they've added multiplayer, which has made me sad. Oh, you don't have to be sad about multiplayer. I always hate the people that are just like, oh, multiplayer. Oh, no, but it's just like they just tack it on. Well, not all the time. Uh, I found the, I found the exit, by the way. Oh yeah. Um. Yeah. They when they first announced it, they were like, "Oh, we're never going to do multiplayer. We're going to focus on single player." And then they were like, "Oh, wait a minute. We can get you know multiplayer onto it, and it's going to be exactly the same as the entire multiplayer." I think. The dead end. Oh, this is not the exit. Damn it. Yeah, uh, I think it's going to be the same as Uncharted. They might include the um, infected, which would be quite an interesting idea. I hope they do some do something like that. Like maybe you can play as some of the infected. That sounds cool. But have you seen some of the latest previews? No. Uh, loads of game journalists got to play it, and we finally found know what the infected are and what kind of types there are. Oh yeah, so what are they? Well, there's two types. There's stage one infection, which is like. Uh, the early stages of infection, which I the majority the are, I think. Um, they're like your standard zombie. They look like shit, but they know what they're doing. Well, they can see what they're doing. They've still got this human aspect, and they're still trying to fight it. So they, if they're running at you... So they're kind of like from the zombies well, from yeah, and bodies. Like, they can love. Not really, but like... <laughs> they, they, <laughs> that show's pretty cool. The fungus has taken... I'm going to watch it on Tuesday. Um, yeah, the... They know they can see what they're doing. Like they're co conscious of what they're, what's happening. Like the fungus is controlling them, but they're fighting it. Like so, sometimes they will proper like fight it and not try. They will not try and get you. That kind of thing. They're kind of shambling, but f yeah, they're fighting with themselves pretty much. And then you've got the stage two ones, which are called the clickers, which are the ones you know with the fungus all over their heads. But the fungus comes out of their eyes. That sounds disgusting. And so they haven't got any eyes, so they rely on clicking to get your location, almost like a like a. Star. And uh, it's the scariest fucking sound. Honestly, watch some of the pre. It's it's one of the scary. If you make a slight bit of sound, they just charge at you, and then they alert all everything in the vicinity. It's proper scary. Like the noise they make, the clicking noise is pro. And then the stage one zombies moan. But it's a really scary, like it's not like a. What are they so like? They so like a zombie moan. It's like a crying. Moan. Yeah, it's it's maybe not. But that's not that's the Minecraft <laughs> one, isn't it? <laughs> you sounded just like yeah, the Minecraft I guess zombie. I did. And then, but then also so the guy you play as, he's got an ability which lets. It's like, do you ever play Batman Arkham City? Of course I have. It's the like that. it's like detective mode. <laughs> you can see see past walls. It's like because it's the apocalypse. He has to rely more on his senses. That's the story. And he's got a heightened sense of sound. And he can... So if he hears a bit of movement on the other side of the wall, he can see that. Do you see what I mean? So he's got this, like, vision where we can kind of see through walls, but only slightly. Which I think mm. adds quite a lot. And I'm quite looking forward to seeing how that plays out. Sounds cool. Yeah. Did you the meat? And at the start of the game... Did you get the stuff down there? Apparently, it starts out as three people, right, but the only it. game, yeah, but the only gameplay we've seen is of two people. So that leads me to believe that the third person may, might die <laughs> early on in the game. Ooh. But the whole premise is like the little girl Ellie. You have to um, take out of this safe zone across the country because I think they believe that she's the cure to the infection, which is pretty cool. Yeah, but I'm not really looking forward to fighting the zombies. I'm more looking forward to fighting the humans because I think that'll play out a lot better. 
Yeah. So I'm, yeah, as I said, I'm really looking forward to that game. It's going to be amazing. Hopefully, it's Naughty Dog. It, you know. It, yeah. Yeah, they have a pedigree. Uh, sh- should we talk about? Okay. Well, I'm just saying, should we talk about February twentieth? Oh yeah, February twentieth, PlayStation Four. What could be the biggest troll in inter- entertainment history? Yeah. Got it. Yeah. It's like the PlayStation Vita Slim. No! Or like the PlayStation Eye Camera <laughs> HD or something. Ugh. It would make me cry. Yeah. But yeah, it would be I a don't joke know whether it's going it to be announced. the PlayStation 4. It would be a giant failure on their part if they didn't. Right? Yeah. It wouldn't be really let down, it'd be fucking funny. So it'd be really funny if like Jack Tratton comes on and he's like, it's not the PlayStation, you know, or something like that. And then he, he actually sings a troll song. Yeah, it, just, it just comes on and he goes, la 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 That'd be fucking hilarious. Just got all these people here and they were like, on the screen comes on like, PlayStation 4, question mark. And then at the end, it's like, no. And then and all, the, all the people in the room were just like, what the fuck? That would just be the best thing. I kind of hope they do that. Just proper troll all these journalists. Because they've got all... Everyone's eyes are on PlayStation at the moment. Because of... They've got some really good exposure. Yeah, everybody's looking at so PlayStation. So they don't need to announce the PlayStation 4. <laughs> because of the... Exp- yeah, but you never know what they're going to announce at these things. Uh, they could even be talking about Wonder Books for crying out loud. Yeah. I such high hope. Or, you know, PlayStation Move. Mm. Yeah, what if they say, oh, we have some Wonderbooks DLC? Like the first hours talking about Wonderbook. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that would be a giant fail. They do. And the PlayStation. The reason why is because it just doesn't sell. Like, people may love it. I don't want to. But it doesn't sell. I'm pretty sure they'll be saying, yeah, I... No, of course it isn't. Have you seen it? God. Honestly. Oh, uh, some news came to, out today, which I think you'll find very surprising. Activision have said that the next Call of Duty is coming out this year. <gasps> Holy... Yeah, I kind of, like, just facepalm when I saw news outlets actually write this story. Like... One of the CEOs of, of Activision said that Call of Duty is the leading innovation in shooters. <laughs> innovation in Call of Duty? Are you serious? Oh, it's more like iteration than innovation. <laughs> right? There's no innovation between... I mean, look at Modern Warfare 2 and Modern Warfare 3. What is the change between the two <laughs> Other than shooting different people? There is nothing. Actually, you don't even shoot different people. Uh, I mean, I must admit, Black Ops 2 was very entertaining. And I yeah, loved it. Yeah, it was a pretty good game. I mean, it was a massive change. Obviously, you're still shooting and stuff. And yeah, okay. But... you have any iron? No. Oh, yeah, do. Got 23. Yay! Yeah. So, for, what do you think is going to happen, though? Like, do you think they're going to show off some games? Do you think they'll... they'll oh, do you think they'll just straight out announce it? Do you think they're going to show... I think they'll just announce it and not have a date or price or anything. It might do a tech demo. Mm. You never know. Maybe. They might show prototypes, but they did for the Vita, if you remember, right? That was called the NGP, wasn't it? Yeah. Do you remember? Oh, yeah. When that was first That's announced. Right. I think it was two E3s ago, or last E3, or no, two E3s oh, yeah. ago. Um, they were like, oh, it's the NGP, the next generation portable. And they showed the prototype and the games that would be on it. But I think they might. Do- yeah, I mean, usually they save that stuff for E3. They might do the same with the next PlayStation. They, they might show a tech demo. I don't think they're going to announce price. I don't think they're going to announce it. No, of course not. But have you heard the rumours about the dates? Yeah, something about like September or something. To coincide with like Grand Theft Auto 5. Uh, Japan and the US are getting it this year. And Europe will be getting it next year. Hmm. Europe gets shafted again. You're going to get it before me. I'm going to be so annoyed. You'll be like, look at this. And I'll be like, oh, God, that. <laughs> Europe always gets shafted. Yeah. 
Oh. They're not. It's not going to be on next-gen consoles because they said that September is their release date. That it's not going to change really now, is it? But consoles won't be out by then. Not a chance. There, there is not enough time between E3 and September for consoles to come out. So GTA might get an iteration on the consoles. I mean, GTA 5, sorry, might get ported to the new consoles. I'm guessing... Oh, sorry. Um, yeah, I'm guessing the, the PC version might get ported to the consoles because obviously the PC version is going to be a lot better graphically. But it's not going to come out for a straight release, is it, really? But this is what surprises me because um, EA have said that they're going to unveil the next details about Battlefield 4. Oh, yeah. In the coming months. And obviously in the coming months, we'll know whether there's next-gen consoles. So I think they are waiting for the announcement of next gen consoles. So they announce their game for the next gen consoles. Do you see what I mean? Yeah, sounds right. I'm pretty sure that in the next few months we will get announcements for both Xbox and next PlayStation. Did you hear the new rumors about Xbox? I've well, heard they, some things. The new rumors are saying that it's going to be an online only system. <laughs> they can solve for that. Not everyone has an Xbox. Yeah. I mean, sorry. Yeah, I meant to say, like, not everyone has the yeah, internet. Like... What do I mean? Yeah, no one has... I, 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 I think... Not everyone has the internet. That's ridiculous. It worked PC. They slowly, they slowly brought that in with certain PC games. But for Xbox to all just be online only, it won't work. I mean, the U- UK has the worst internet speeds in the whole of Europe. You, it's a pretty wow, big really? fucking continent, okay? So, like, it's it's very, very, very difficult for that to actually... Yeah, well, it's obviously not going to work. It's definitely not going to work. Yeah, in Canada, we have, like, bandwidth limits, too, and all that kind of stuff. And I hear that my friends are saying that they're going to move to PC. Do you know PC what? That's exactly what I said. Like, if the PlayStation does look like shit, or the Xbox looks like shit, then, you know, you've lost, they've lost me. I'm going for PC. Everyone come to PC, yes. Remember how everyone said that PC gaming was dead when yeah. the new consoles came out? It's like, why do you need a PC anymore? You have these consoles. Yeah. Uh, definitely. Are you okay? It looks like you're just staring. Exactly. Steam has was a huge influence on PC gaming. <laughs> Thanks to Steam. Thanks to Steam. Steam kind of saved PC. But yeah, that's that's what I have to say. Thank you, Gaben. Yeah. I usually have a lot of problems with Steam. I don't know. When I have, have two PCs I don't use it I want to play it's one that's offline. It's okay. You can't play your games. It's okay. great. Yeah. And you just... Yeah. Have you tried out big picture mode yet? Uh, I have. I haven't tried it. Because I haven't got a decent enough... I, like, my TV is actually smaller than my laptop screen, so it's kind of pointless. <laughs> I have. It's nice. I like the interface. It's sleek. But I don't really need to use yeah. it because I have a desktop. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yeah, definitely. So, movies we're looking forward to? Uh, I am free. Star Trek. Iron Man 3, Star Trek. Um, shit, what else? Uh, Wreck It Ralph. Wreck-It Ralph. That came out this year. Uh, Wreck It Ralph's coming out next week wow. in the UK, which has been out been out in the US since November. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, been in the US since November. So, yeah. But I'm looking forward to seeing that. I love Pixar. So, like, have you seen um, the short they made? The recent short, uh, Paper Man? Nope. So good. Nope. It's really, really good. Pixar are fantastic at creating stories. Yeah. Uh, other films? Uh, I don't know of any other really films know off the top of my head. Do you know of any films? Just try just, just off the top of your head. I think Thor comes out this year. Is it this year? Because I thought it was next well, year. But it might be this year. Because I think they're releasing two a year. So it might be the new four. And I think Captain America's next year. It's either Captain America this year or next year. Or Thor this year or next year. There's rumours that the next Avengers is going to be against the Hulk. Didn't they already fight the Hulk? 
Well, no, because in the com, no, because in the comic, they they kind of get pissed off with Falk and they send him off into space. And yeah, that'd be really awesome Avengers movie. What X Men versus Avengers? <laughs> that's not going to happen. Well, why not? <laughs> but they've got to at some point do Civil well, War. One of the Avengers films has yeah, to be Civil. Yeah, exactly. That's probably my favorite. I'm reading that right now. <sighs> Has that got yeah. Civil War in it? Yeah. Civil War is the best. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. Uh, yeah, but like, yes, yeah, that, yeah. I haven't read any of that, admittedly. But I know a lot from a friend that reads a lot. The next one, my friend says, is going to be about the Affinity Gauntlet. Yeah. 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 Um, so yeah, they've got to do the Civil War at some It'd point. It would be so badass cause because they have... Yeah, well, it, they're going to have to kind of lead into it. It won't like be the, the next, next... Avengers, I don't think. But the Civil War will will be pretty amazing. I'm making oh. glass. Oh, well, the next... I'm stealing well, they have all your the glass. X-Men movies, and it'd be pretty cool if they could combine the X-Men with the Avengers. But what other films can you think of, then? I don't know. I can't really think of anything. Yeah, it's just Star Trek. Trek. It's not like last year. If we had had this conversation last year, it'd be like Batman and yeah. Avengers and all that sort of stuff. Do you know what I mean? We'd have been a definitive list. But there's also Man of Steel, right? See, I didn't like Dark Knight Rises as much as I did Dark Knight or the Avengers. I think the Avengers was brilliant. Yeah, Avengers is probably my favorite movie of that year. Uh, sorry, I'm a geek to the heart. I was I was nerdgasming all over the seats, well, all over the seats. Do, do you remember that? One <laughs> the scene? seats were sticky. After <laughs> them. Do you remember that one scene? You know what I'm talking about. That one scene in the movie where all the swoops between. All oh the my engines. god! God, don't don't remind me. Don't yeah, remind me. That, that <laughs> scene is probably. I have to change my pants. I freaked out in my seat <laughs> at the theater during that scene. Yeah, it's bloody amazing. <sighs> so good. So, I love it. Yeah, it's looking alright. But yeah, I think Man is Steel and that's it. It doesn't matter. You're just too picky. You got like OC. Yeah, I know, right? I have... It's my Minecraft. Think, it's not real. Life. I think the house look better. I don't like the uh, the front bit. Nah, it needs like a roof. No, we need windows. It's just a bit plain. Yeah, we'll do the windows first, I guess. What am I doing? I have an axe. You could have my axe. Friggin' Lord of the Rings. I haven't got any glass. Oh, wait, I do. Yes, you do. Yeah. There's also a bunch of stone, uh-huh. too. Glass. Oh, it is. Yeah. So, I'm and it's steel. That out. Yeah, definitely. And steel. I know it's directed by, like, Zack Snyder. He did, like, 300 watch. Yeah. I mean, he's mostly known for slow-mo. Do you remember the last Superman film? Yes. I thought it was okay. That was fucking awful. Yeah. I don't remember it too well. But oh, I no, it was, okay. it was an abomination. <laughs> Honestly, it was absolutely terrible. Like, like, he hasn't had a really good movie in God knows what happened. Oh, here's a... Did you watch the Dice Awards or read about uh, the Dice Awards? After? No, not really. It blew up my Twitter feed and I just kind of assumed uh, by it. Uh, it's not crap. It's the best gaming awards. Oh, it's not... Voted for... I didn't say it was crap. Okay. Well, Journey won pretty much every single award, including Game of the Year. That's cool. Jo- I love Journey. J- Journey won awards such as Best Online. That's pretty cool. <laughs> which was weird. Which is weird, but think about it. It works because it did have a really good online system, even though I don't think the connection was very good and I kept having loads of different people. Well, think of it this way. I never had the same person throughout the whole game. Yeah, you never had the same person throughout the whole game. And think of it this way. Uh, that game, that online was pretty crazy. Like, uh, my experience with that game, I had this guy come into my game, and we had to fight our yep. way up the snow mountain. It was a struggle to go through the snow. And there's these monsters that kind of look like stingrays in a metal. I, I don't know what they there isn't a name for them. Yeah, I don't remember what they're, they're big flying robot looking things. Yeah. They swoop down and if they see you, if they see you, they see you, they lock onto you, don't they? Yeah. They like go red and they just, they do. They look like they're swimming in the air. Yeah. 
Yeah. So he, this, this, I was trying to tell my buddy that there was one behind him. And to, yep. I was like yelling at him, "Look out! Look out!" And he knocked him, and I thought I killed him. But then I traveled like a, a few feet later, yeah. and he could have made it to the next checkpoint. <laughs> Getting really emotional. Like, oh, no, my friend. <laughs> yeah. Very emotional. <laughs> but yeah, that was my experience with that game. You can't actually die in Journey. Oh, no? You can't? I yeah. you could. Oh. And then if you go too, get too far away from them, it kicks, it kicks them out. Yeah. Oh, so my, my so you have to kind of stay really close there. to each other. I didn't know that. How many times have you played oh, through it? I feel it? pretty bad. Uh, just <sighs> once. Play through it multiple times. Get all of the glyphs, which give you know the glyphs that give you... Um, uh, make, they they make your scarf you longer, jump. yeah. Yeah. Oh, they make your scarf I'm no longer. No longer that type of person. What the hell? I can't get in the bed. Where it's are you? In the way. bed. I'm in the cabin. You're not here at all. I'm totally in. The are you cabin. in the house? Are you yes. fucking serious? Can you see me? Yeah, I, I can see you. You're I can't see you. Stuff. Really? Okay. Uh, hang on, let me log out and log back in. No. Holy crap, I'm outside See? the house. <laughs> you're over the there. <laughs> uh, that's weird. What happened? We had some I serious know, case of lie. Like... Totally. Of course I do, because I'm way better. No one just wasn't letting you sleep in the bed. You were nowhere near the bed. <laughs> 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 yeah. But yeah, man. Oh, Damn it. You should. My friend is trying to um get all the achievements for it. Resident Evil. Oh my <laughs> god, he needs It's me. not worth it. it. <laughs> Damn it. Resident Evil 6 is fucking yeah. awful. It's not worth it for even the achievements. Oh man. I'm gonna take, fix up this house a little bit. They said they're rebooting Resident Evil as well. Really? Uh, I... How long have we been talking for? Uh, about an hour and a half. Christ. <laughs> it's going to take a long time for you to render this one. You have no idea. No. Oh, tits. Oh, what happened? Uh, Creeper just blew the shit out of me. Oh, no. Are you okay? Um, I'm okay. Could be better. <laughs> Everything can be better. Yeah. Uh, I think well, I think we've covered pretty much everything. So, um, I think that's it. One more thing. Okay. I mentioned something about projects. Yeah, projects. There's a new project that myself. <laughs> what? 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 What's the project? What? There's a place called the projects. Oh. Yeah, there's a place called the projects. It's just a oh, slang for okay. slums. Oh, it's a term that I don't use. So I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, we've got a, well myself and a few of us, including dear Thomas over here. That's me, Tante Kane though. It's Thomas. It's Tante Kane. <clears throat> Thomas. Tante Kane. The name isn't Tante Kane. My name is Tante. Come on, his name isn't Tante Kane. He's a liar. He's a liar. He lied to you. Your enemy shooter on Tante Kane. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's what I call. It's him, not so. Gross Squadron. <laughs> Yeah, but we're starting yeah, uh, a new it's new. Project. It's codenamed Project Codes. Yeah. Rogue. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, we're not going to use the name Rogue Squadron, considering me and Thomas can't fucking say it. Why can't uh, I get in this door? I, What's the matter with this I, door? I, 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 I kept closing it whenever you opened it. Oh, you jerk. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, it's Project Rose Squadron at the moment. It's obviously a working title. We don't know what to call it. Um, we're going to be making our own website, which is going to be awesome. It's not going to be like all the other crappy game websites I've worked with in the past. <laughs> yeah, it's not going to be any of that. I'm leaving my position at my current place in order to work. Yeah, yeah in order to make it awesome. I'm going to be investing a lot of money and a lot of time in said project and I'm pretty sure Thomas or Tainted Kane will inform you all in the near future. Alright, sure. that's it everybody. See you guys later. There's yes. a link to the thing in the yeah. bottom of
the description. So, oh, so yeah. I'll be 